Today, I am going to create this circle morph animation in Canva. Go to canva.com. Click on the video. Select the landscape video. First, change the background color to ash. Go to elements and add a circle frame. Duplicate the frame. Upload your different food plate pictures. I am using demo pictures. Double click to adjust the frame. Add the rest of the pictures. Place all the plates together. I want the protein plate above all the plates. That is why changing the position to the forward. Now select all the plates and go to animate. Apply circle add-on effects with the lowest speed. Go to elements and add a circle. Change the color to white. Duplicate this. Add a circle shape to the upper circle. Select the shape and circle and make it a group. Select all the elements and drag them to the bottom of the page. Add a text and write the food name. Change the font color to white. Select the Gogolin font. Go to Animate and select the Blur animation with maximum speed and writing style line. Again, add a text. Write the food details. Select the Montserrat font. Duplicate the text and write the food name with 15 to 20 spaces between every food name. Make all the letters uppercase. Go to Effects. Select the Curve effect.
Rotate the upper circle shape and set the bold circle to the food name according to the food plate. Use the arrow button to adjust the circle's position. Add two elements of the food to the top left and right sides. Change the background color to the food theme color. Add arrow button. Duplicate the page. Change the bold circle position to the next food name. Adjust the position with the keyboard arrow buttons. Click on the food plate and go to the position. Drag the next food plate picture above all the plates. Change the food name. Change the background color. Add the food elements as before. Change the food details. I am using dummy text for the details. Duplicate the page and do the same thing for the rest of the food. Click here to add the match and move transition with one second duration. Apply to all pages. Page timing will be 2.5 and apply to all pages. Here is the final result. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.